What's going on everyone? Welcome to Film 101 and today we're going to show you per request how easy it is to actually use the Switchboard app that we posted a couple days ago and how awesome it is and everything like that. But how easy is it to use? Well today we're going to show you how easy it is to use. So stay tuned. <laughs> So now we have the app open and you can see all the cameras that we've set out throughout the room. One over here at the projector. Um, subscribe for giveaways. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> and then another one over there facing me, which actually the delay on it's really good now. Um, but, and so pretty much I'm going to show you guys how easy it is to run this app. Um, first off, let's go to the subs for giveaways. Um, zooming in and out. So pretty much same as you do on the phone. You're controlling the phone by one app. Flipping the cameras. Um, let's go to Allen's. Actually, we'll go, yeah. So now that we have Allen's iPhone, right over here, you can just tap and it will flip the camera completely around, right there on the little camera indicator. Um, Let's see what else we can take it. Um, these are all of the connected phones, being able to flip all of them. We're running just the audio. Well, I mean, I am obviously have my lav mic on, but we're just collecting the audio just from the built-in from the iPad. So anyways, let's, um, let's take this one for instance. Now, this is your live, and to record, you just hit record right up here, but this is your live. This is your preview. So say that we wanted to send it as live, we would just take something and preview to live, and that sends it over. Now, your transitions down here, you can just cut it, cross dissolve, wipe, cube, twist, which I can go through those real quick. Even if I were to cut, take that, preview to live, boom, it just cuts it straight over, and that leaves your preview empty for whatever you're working on next. Cross dissolve, go to the projector, preview live, and it'll cross dissolve under what you're recording. Now let's take um, Alan's phone over here, and we're going to wipe it, preview to live, and we'll wipe it over. <laughs> and uh, let's see, actually I'm gonna go back over to Alan's iPhone, and um, cube, preview to live, or whoops, actually, that is live, cube. No, wait, we were already on that. Let's go back here, cube, preview to live, and it'll rotate it like a cube, or twist, preview to live, preview to live, twists over to me. Again, it leaves your preview open for your next, your next cut, your next transition. Take it and um, cross dissolve, preview to live. And you're doing all this while recording. It's not recording right now just because we're recording over my shoulder and showing you guys how to run this app. Um, but we're not recording it. We're recording back there, not up here. We're just showing you guys. Here we can take each camera and we can take off the autofocus to manual, take the exposure to manual, the white balance to manual, um, turn the stabilization off, disable autofocus when in live. So then let's say that I have um, something like this, for instance, preview to live, take me up, and we'll select it, and I disable autofocus when live, straight to manual focus, and I'm sending that to live, I can choose focus between me and the camera, even though it's we're both pretty much in focus right now, but I can select that by disabling autofocus when live. I can turn off the stabilization, or I can turn on and off the light. So now let's try that with Alan's phone. Telly, oh, there we go, and it's super bright, and down. But that's really cool. I really like that. Here we have the main audio channel. Like I said before, we're just re collecting it off of the iPad Pro and um, show auxiliary channels. If you're running any auxiliary channels, that's all the other ones. 
um, two, three, and four around the room. And last but not least, graphic elements. If um, there is a small fee um, for that, but it's little things like this. Preview to live. Beep. Actually, no. I want to change that. Let's let's do this real quick. Um, we'll change the cross dissolve or the transition to a cut. Bring that preview to live. That's a cut. Go back over here to our graphics. Well, for like logos, whatever you want on there, and say that actually preview to live. Bring that up, and I'm saying my thing, and we want it to like it's cut, and it's just beep. Um, preview to live. Boom, and it just cuts. And that's all in transitions, multi view to um, dashboard, flap, slots, picture and picture. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, it's insanely easy. Preview to live, back to the subs. Subscribe for giveaways. We have another one coming. From here, going um, the subscribe for giveaways, make sure you subscribe. Preview that to live. Wait a second. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Alan. Seriously? Don't. Really? So, but yeah, and literally zooming in, zooming out. I'm gonna zoom all of these out because I think, ooh, that's kind of cool. That was from the picture in picture, showing two of them. And then, being that we have both of those going, preview to live. Being that we already had that one up and we're just bringing that one in, slides in, slots, split pretty much, or Split view, um, split screen, flap. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that too. Preview to live. Um, dashboard. And that's putting all of them into one giant roll of all the different cameras. But that's pretty much it. That's how easy it is per, you know, to use this app under the request of how easy is it to actually use this app all of those are live but let's get out of here let's change that none go up here change it to uh, let's cross dissolve whatever and send it back to me as you can see the camera's right there and that's it um so reversed wise you can go up here or no i'm sorry over here and subscribe to film 101 we probably have some videos down here for you guys to see but as always have fun shooting um subscribe if you'd like we do have our next set of giveaways coming um so please subscribe and like the video if you like the video and we'll see you next time